Hey everyone, how's it going? God Gamer here. Today I'm going to be playing the Hunter's Journal, which is like the Hollow Knight version of Wordle. But instead of using random words, it selects a random entry from the Hunter's Journal, and you have to make guesses, and whenever you make a guess, it compares the statistics of the guess that you made to the statistics of the enemy that was randomly selected. So let me just show you how this works based off this example. So if you take a look at this bottom entry, this is the first guess that the player made. So they guess Great Husk Century, and the game tells them that the enemy isn't in the City of Tears, it requires more than 10 kills to complete the journal entry, it has less than 170 health, and it drops less than 50 geo. Their next guess, Shroomling, shows that the enemy requires 20 kills to complete the journal entry. And eventually they find out the enemy is within Deep Nest, and then they guess Little Weaver, which is the correct enemy. So huge shout outs to Nerf Irelia for making this game. It's just such a cool game. You can play it, I'll link in the description. So if you just want to play it, click on that link and you can enjoy the game yourself. I'm going to be playing free play, but there is like a daily puzzle, just like in Wordle, where you can kind of all have the same enemy that you're guessing each day and you can share your results with other people. So that's really cool. I'm going to be doing free play because I'm going to be playing like maybe five or so games. But let's just get started with a random guess, Shroomal Warrior, my favorite guy. And based off this guess, we can see the enemy is not in Fungal Wastes. It requires less than 20 kills to complete the journal entry. It has more than 20 health, and it drops less than 8 Geo. Right off the bat, there is potential for this to be a boss enemy, because most bosses don't drop any Geo. They have a lot of health, and they don't require many kills to beat. So I'm just gonna guess maybe Markoth. And definitely this is a boss enemy because more than 705 health, definitely a boss, no Geo drops, and it requires one kill. Also, Markoth has more HP than any other Dream Warrior, so it rules out all the other Dream Warriors. Next up, I'm gonna guess Lost Kin because this is a boss with kind of a middle amount of health compared to other bosses. Now we know the boss has between 705 and 1200 HP. Dung Defender actually has perfectly almost between those two values, so I'm going to guess Dung Defender next. We can see it's above 900 HP. Now I could guess God Tamer, but we already know the enemy is not inside of Kingdom's Edge, so God Tamer is ruled out. Hive Knight is a possibility, but I kind of want to see if there's a better guess that's more between 900 and 1200. I think Grim is definitely a better guess than Hive Knight, so let's guess Grim. Okay, and it is Grim. So there we go. Five guesses for a boss enemy is not too shabby. Definitely, if you have a smaller enemy, you usually take a few less guesses to get them. But with a boss enemy, it's a lot tougher to narrow them down because they pretty much all require one kill to complete the journal entry. And most of them also drop zero geo. So you're basically just guessing based off the area and the HP, and you have to get pretty lucky to get the area. So let's play another game. I'm gonna start by guessing one of these basic husks. Oh, and interesting. This time it's less Geo, so it might be a zero Geo enemy, but it also has less health too. One thing I should note is that some enemies are multiple area enemies, and that just means that the enemy spawns in multiple different areas. So this is ruling out an enemy that spawns in multiple areas, meaning that the enemy that the game selected is a single area enemy. So the first enemy that came to mind for me was the Aspid Hatchling. So I'm going to guess this. So at least this confirms it's a zero geo enemy. Yeah, so the two enemies that come to mind now are either like there's not that en many enemies that have less than five HP. So Life Seed is a journal entry, and there's also the Jellyfish in Fog Canyon. However, it's not Life Seed because Life Seed is multiple area. 
So I'm going to guess the Uoma. Okay, so it's a Fog Canyon enemy. Okay, hold on. Hold on a minute. It says less than one health. What enemy has less than one health? <laughs> so we do know the enemies in Fog Canyon. That helps narrow things down a lot. And Monomon is not in the list. I don't know what's in the Hunter's Journal. I am a speedrunner, not a lore guy. Maybe we should get Moss back to play this game instead of me. <laughs> okay, so like less than one HP. This is actually the Luma Flies. Right? Yeah, this is a Luma Fly. Charged Luma Fly. Okay. I actually don't remember how to even get this journal entry. <laughs> Let's play another game. Okay, so this time we're going with my other favorite guy, which is the Moss Charger. Oh no, don't tell me this is a boss again. Once again, we're going to go with the Markoth strat. Oh, it's another boss. But the Dream Warriors are not ruled out because it's less than 705 HP this time. So I could guess, uh, oh, not False Knight because False Knight drops Geo. I think Gorb might be a good guess because it's kind of like a middling amount of HP. So it's less than 570. That means zero Marmu, Galeon, uh, No Eyes are all ruled out. Elder Who's also ruled out. I wonder if it's, I wonder if it's actually the meme, which is Zote. Oh no, Kingdom's Edge just ruled out. It's not the meme. Okay. <laughs> oh wait, it could be. No way, it's not Massive Moss Charger. Massive Moss Charger drops Geo. I just thought it would be funny if it was the massive version of my first pick. So it's n not Hornet because Hornet requires two entries to uh, complete. I wonder if it's Luke Mar. Lukewarm is probably a pretty good guess. It does fit. Oh, okay, more than 350. Oh, damn it. <laughs> oh, oh, okay, it's gotta be Broken Vessel, right? I don't think there's any other option. Yeah, it's Broken Vessel. Okay. <laughs> that one was tough. I was actually thinking about that one for a while. <laughs> okay, let's... Let's go with the Mosquito. Oh, it's a green path enemy. That's rare that you get the area first. <laughs> so less kills than 25, more than 10 health, more than 5 Geo. So it could be like a Moss Knight, perhaps? Oh, it's not Moss Knight. Oh, less than 8 kills. So it's not Hornet, because Hornet does not drop Geo. This could probably be Massive Moss Charger, right? Yeah, it's Massive Moss Charger. Nice. Getting a boss in three guesses is very good, I think. Let's guess one of the Mantises. Mantis Petra. Ooh, 45 HP enemy. 45 HP enemy, but drops less than 12 Geo and requires less than 16 kills. Interesting. So, right now I'm thinking of a Loodle, but, oh, oh, is it, the, is it the Death Loodle? Oh, it's a, f oh wait, what, what the hell could it be? <laughs> 45 health, zero Geo. I will, so it's not an, my first thought is, okay, it's zero Geo, it's an enemy from the Coliseum, but it's not in Kingdom's Edge, that means it's not a Colosseum enemy. This is such a, a tough one. <laughs> like, how how many enemies can have 45 health but zero Geo? <laughs> oh my god, it's... It is the grub. It's the grub. Ah, uh, this, is, this is why I hate grubs. They make things so difficult. Grub Mimic. This is not an enemy that I would think of. <laughs> Holy crap, I'm surprised I got that one in three. Okay, I'm gonna go with a City of Tears enemy this time. Let's go with a Heavy Sentry. Let's try that one out. Oh, Kingdom's Edge. Okay, so it's not God Tamer. Collectors in the City of Tears, right? Pale Lurker. Yeah. What? It's not the Pale Lurker? No. <laughs> it's Zoat. Zoot is in Kingdom's Edge. <laughs> oh my god, I got trolled on that one. 
What the hell, Zote? <laughs> you never expect a Zote to be the boss. <laughs> well, I hope you all enjoyed the video. I had a lot of very interesting journal entries that time, so it was a lot of fun. Again, huge shout outs to Nerf Aurelia for making this. It's a really, really cool game, and you should all give it a shot. So check out the description to play the game. But thank you all for watching. Hope you have a wonderful day. Peace. Oh.